selected error control codes, humming codes, part 1 regular humming code, part 2 shortened code and part 3 extended humming code. From previous screencast we know that columns of matrix H, parity check matrix, are syndromes of the received uh, word V. If all syndromes are distinct, then each syndrome points out the distinct error pattern and then syndrome error pattern lookup table can be uh, can be used, constructed and used to uh, detect error pattern. Now, number of non-zero syndromes in block code is 2 to the power of m minus 1. m is number of check bits. Number of single errors uh, in a code of the code word length n is n. Then, to correct every single error, number of syndromes should be equal or greater than number of single error patterns. For humming code, this is equality, n is equal to the power of m minus 1. This code has a minimum distance of 3, which enables correction of every single error. The Hamming code syndrome is expressed as the binary number. Originally, syndrome is a column vector. We express this column, uh, column vector as the binary number. S sub 1 is the last bit, S sub m is the uh, left bit. And after binary to decimal uh, conversion, this syndrome points the column where it is located. For example, syndrome, uh, Hamming syndrome, all zeros and one, is in the first column, corresponds to decimal one, and so on. There is no need to use syndrome error pattern lookup table for Hamming code. Uh, the decimal Hamming syndrome is just number of, of bit that should be corrected. Uh, Hamming syndrome uh, after binary to decimal conversion points, points erroneous bit. Now placement of uh, check bits. We know from previous consideration that check bits are, should be and they are determined solely by the information bits, which means that in each parity check equation only one uh, check bit is present uh, and it means that columns of matrix H that are at the check bit positions contain only one non-zero entry. It is the first column, 2 to the power of 0, second, 2 to, two to the power of 1, fourth, eighth, and so on. Humming code is the non-systematic code. This is the observation. And now Humming code 7.4, first code in the class of Humming codes. Its uh, code word length is 7, number of check bits 3, uh, and then syndrome number of uh, information bits 4 means, means that 16 messages can be encoded. Syndrome of the ith single error is the ith column of the parity check matrix. Then in the first column we have 1, second 2, 3, up to the seventh column. Here we have 7. Uh, error syndrome corresponding to uh, every single error pattern can be calculated for error pattern. Uh, error of the first leftmost position, we will obtain the following syndrome. We will obtain the following syndrome, which is in the first column. Uh, then after uh, binary to decimal uh, conversion, it is one, first column. And same for six other syndromes for six other single errors. In second column, Hamming syndrome is two, in third, three, in seventh, seven. Parity check bits uh, are designated uh, from parity check equa equations. Uh, information bits designate parity check bits. For example, P sub 1 is designated by the third bit, which is I sub 1, the fifth, which is I sub 2, and the seventh, which is I sub 4, and two other parity check bits. These are parity check equations. And then we obtain the code word that contains information bits and parity check bits. This is uh, in this table we have all code words for all 16 messages. Information words. Now decoding. Decoder for the received word 
calculates the error syndrome, it is a column vector, then decoder writes this syndrome as the binary word, like this, like this. Then this binary word is converted to decimal to give a number i, and this number i designates error, or if i is zero, then no error. If i is different than zero, then z sub i is one, all other bits of uh, error pattern are zero. We add error pattern to the received word to obtain the decision. Please observe that humming code is a single error correcting code and double errors are recognized, however erroneously uh, corrected. They are treated as single errors. Then probability of erroneous decision for humming code is number around number of uh, all probability of all this is number of all uh, double errors and this is probability of uh, double error then uh, probability of all double errors is probability of erroneous decision of um, humming code now exemplary transmission let us assume that this is a word at the channel output input of the decoder step one parity check sums and we from these sums we calculate the syndrome v sub 1 v sub 3 v sub 5 v sub 7 gives 0 s sub 2 is 1 s sub 3 is 0 then this syndrome is expressed as a binary word and this binary word is converted to decimal which is 2 which means that we have error at the second bit this is error pattern added to the received word gives the decision which is 11th message uh, w11 uh, of our uh, set of code words shortened coming code it is the second part of this screencast